Hey Libras, I'm back y'all. So yeah, definitely this is my third time doing this reading for you guys. So I'm kind of getting like y'all energy was just kind of like a little all over the place. So I didn't want to push those readings out because they were all over the place. So we're going to do this one last time. And if, if this one doesn't bring any balance then i'm just going to do y'all's tomorrow <laughs> because the energy right now is just like mm, yeah no <laughs> all right so give me a message for libras please give me a message for libras all right we got a jumper and the seven of wands so you're Defensive. You're on the defense side. Getting like y'all going off on somebody, and I keep getting that energy, it's the same energy. But we're gonna see how this goes. I'm hearing, I'm gonna make sure that you know that we together. I'm gonna make it known that you know that we together. And I see you sitting back waiting for things to pop off. Like, what is going on? The Seven of Pentacles and the Five of Wands. Yeah, like, there's competition, Empress. There's this, like, battle, possibly over a man or a woman, whatever. But there's this, like, competition, Somebody stole, feel like somebody stole somebody, man. Like, what is this? What is this? Ugh, I don't want to read this energy. But somebody may need this. So I'm going to try to find a way to, to turn this into a positive. Let's see what's going on. I feel like you know this person feels some type of way. And you don't care. <laughs> um, Eight of Wands. Yeah, you know this person talking about you. This person brags a lot about what they got. Queen of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. This person could be like real good financially. Well, we had the devil. The situation toxic, okay? Could be dealing with the Capricorn. Okay. All right, so some of y'all could be going to get readings. Some of y'all could be going to get readings. You're either getting readings or you're getting an you're getting advice on how you should handle a situation.
Because it seems like you're regret, like you're having regrets. It seems like you're having regrets. Like you're having regrets. So it looks like some of y'all either went to a reader or you're planning on going to a reader because it's like the results you don't do. You, you ain't get how it didn't come out how you thought it was going to come out. So I see the magician here. The challenge is manifesting things going, um, you orchestrating something here. Yeah, it's like somebody moved out of town and it changed everything. Something isn't fair. Possibly, like, you feel like something is not fair. Um, yeah, like something made the situation worse. So you got to, it seems like you were getting advice from somebody or you went and got a reading, but it just made the situation worse. Yep. This person could have changed locations. Somebody that you're dealing with, they changed, they changed locations, moved into a different home, moved out of town, and something just made the situation worse. Like this person could have um, up and left. And this is making the situation worse. Um, yep, I see. I see disagreements. Five of Wands here. And confusion. Yeah. There's a lot of confusion in regards to a connection. It's a lot of confusion. So maybe you're deciding maybe you need to go get a reading because you feel like the situation is worse. I feel I see you asking somebody how much it costs, and you can see it and if you can afford it or not. Um, but I see some some of y'all are going to going to a reader. Y'all are going to a reader. Y'all are going to a reader. Y'all going to a reader, or y'all could be paying someone to do some spell work for you. Now we got the five of pentacles here in the recent past. Okay, so you felt left out. You feel like things weren't going in your favor. You could have told this person this. I feel like you already went and got this advice. You already went to this reader. They could have told you. Um, they could have told you. Gave you some advice. And gave you a lot of hope. Could have gave you a lot of hope for the situation. And I feel like you was waiting on it. But maybe you found out that somebody was cheating, getting cheated on. Maybe you found out that there's a third party involved. I just saw the three of swords. And the seven of swords. I see like you there was something I, I'm getting like some spell work involved because I feel like somebody keeps changing the time frame on when something is going to be completed. Yeah, I'm getting some spell work being involved. Okay. So I see somebody got some spell work done or somebody went to a reader and it looks like it's somewhere along the line. It seemed like it made the situation worse. Now, there could have been a change of plans. Somebody is changing. They're now changing the time frame here. But you was hoping that this was going to be completed and the results, you were going to get better results. And it just seemed like it made the situation worse. Yep, Seven of Pentacles. Yep. You feel like it's not working. King of Cups, Nine of Wands, and the Eight of Pentacles. You feel like it's not working. 
Yep, and you feel like all the work that you, um, everything that you put into it is not working quick enough. That's the problem. And the problem is with the time frame. It's not working fast enough. So you may reach out to this to this person to see what they can do. So it looks like moving ahead, things are on hold, okay? So it looks like you didn't get the results that you wanted, so things get put on hold. I see you waiting. You're waiting for some progress. You're waiting for some movement, but you feel stuck. You feel stuck. Maybe you go back to this, to this person, and you're kind of afraid to tell them what happened something happened i definitely see that there was some type of argument disagreement confusion yep i see somebody king of king of cups and the seven of swords yeah i feel like we got the devil and the king of pentacles here. Definitely could be dealing with the Capricorn. But somebody's like, feel you feel like you got took advantage, taken advantage of. Somebody got taken advantage of. I keep getting, keep seeing this. Somebody could be in the middle of a separation. Up. Maybe you feel like this person is giving off bad energy. Like, maybe you feel like you just went to the wrong person. Like, they just giving off bad vibes. They just giving off bad vibes. And you want your money back. You want your money back. You want your money back because you feel like you got taken for you feel like you got taken advantage of. You think that it should have been things should have been progressing by now. Yeah, this person told you. This person told you that you and this person would be together. Maybe they told you that things were going to be different. But when you looking around, it's a lot of gossiping going on. You looking around, it's like everybody else winning in the situation. And you wanted some results. It didn't go as expected. It did not go as expected. And this is your first time dealing with this person. I feel like you making a big deal about it. Cause you feel like you paid too much money. And then I also see someone could be pregnant here. It did not, something did not go right. Four of cups and a high event. Something didn't go right. Yeah, something did not go right. Something did not go right. I feel like some of y'all went to some of y'all got scammed. Y'all went to some, went and got some advice or went to a reader or went to get some spell work done. Yeah. It was a love spell. The lovers and the moon. It was a love spell. Yep. It was a love spell. 
and it went wrong. It went wrong. Dang it. That's why this energy was so all over the place because I just feel like there's some magic behind it. There's some other forces behind it. Keep in mind this energy could be vice versa. Let's look at this person's energy. Tell me more. Tell me more about this reader's energy. Like this person that Libra's got this work done from. All right, so this person, yeah, their focus is on stability, security, growth, endurance, and flexibility. Okay. So, and this person, um, if you see a picture of this person on, like, if you're contacting this person, it's something about their picture. Like, I don't think that that's their picture. I don't think that's their real picture or their real work. Yeah, like this person ran off. They might have sabotaged. They could have could have messed this, made the situation worse, and ran off. Yeah, because they were only in it for the money, the chaser and abundance. They were only in it for the money. They were in it for the money. I see that you could have wanted to take uh, this connection, a connection that you were in to the next level, but instead, it looks like somebody got scammed. Somebody got scammed. Yeah, I'm saying this person wearing a mask. Um, this person wearing a mask. They're a narcissist too, and they're really self self absorbing. And yep, see, we got karmic relationship acts and wedding. So it looks like a karmic relationship. They, it looks like a situation could be a, a situation could be karmic, and it looks like there was a breakup. Maybe there was a breakup spell involved. I'm seeing breakup spell to break up someone. Break up someone's marriage with the wedding rings here. Yeah, I'm getting like break up someone's marriage or just break up a couple. That could have been what the results that you wanted to see or the results that they could have been promising you. But this person is a damn snake. They're a snake. And it's something about their photograph. It's something about a picture, like pictures that they may have shown you or of things that they've done or things like that. I don't think that is real. This person could have gaslighted you. Yep. I feel like some of y'all got scammed. If it's not, if it's not into, um, like if you haven't got into it with a, a reader or someone who's doing spell work, I just, I'm just getting the energy of scam, 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 scam. You know what I'm saying? Like, so be careful with who you are dishing money out to, um, or asking for to do certain services and things for you. Just be on high alert. Okay. So that's the message that I got for you guys. Ciao for now.